Back, new music Tuesday. John and Jesse and a baby to be named later are now joining us. <laughs> We're one month from today, right? One month. The countdown begins. Congratulations. That's fantastic. Good to see you guys. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, a lot of new stuff and, and some MJ, right? That's right. Michael Jackson. This is interesting. Mm -hmm. It's just entitled Michael. Yeah. And there's 10 tracks that he had been working on prior to his untimely death. Yeah. Got some uh, help from friends Akon and 50 Cent right. and Lenny Kravitz. Right. In fact, the Lenny Kravitz cut, uh, it's in Entitled Another Day. That's one of my favorites. Very 80s sound to it. See that. There you as go. well yeah. as Behind the Mask. Again, another really 80s sounding Michael Jackson right. thing. You can just see him dancing and yeah. hitting the high right. falsetto notes. I love it. Good. Okay, that's out today for Michael Jackson. Then we've got. Yes, Ryan Adams Ryan and Adams. the Cardinals. You know, I believe personally the Cardinals are one of the best bands in rock music today. They're kind of these hired hands <laughs> that. I think are uh, highly underrated, but Ryan Adams and the Cardinals went into the studio back in 07, which they intended to go in for two weeks, and it ended up six months later they came out with Easy Tiger, his yeah. last release, and a lot of other material. So finally, they're releasing that other material as a yeah. double album, Cardinals 3 and 4. It's so it's wonderful, yeah. Okay. All right, Ryan Adams out. Then we've got Crystal Bower Socks, That's right? That's right, the American this Idol runner-up from sure. last year. And Farmer's Daughter is her debut. And Farmer's Daughter is a, a really arresting song. It's about uh, child abuse that she suffered. Really? And, but, I mean, you know, there's there's a great story here because here's this woman that, you know, rose to the, nearly the top right. on right. American Idol. And there's, there's a great song entitled Mason that she did with her husband at uh -huh. their nuptials. So, yeah. I mean, it's just, you know, it's, it's really a... A, a great folk country pop record. And it's good. It's very good. See, coming from you, especially with the pomp and the circumstance around American Idol, it's, it's got to be a good one then. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then we've got... We've got Diddy. Diddy, Diddy. And <laughs> Diddy, Dirty Money, you yes. You can't just say Diddy, Dirty Money. Yeah. Diddy, Diddy. Diddy. <laughs> it's very serious. Right. This is actually supposed to be a concept album about a love affair on the European uh, railways. Mm. Yeah. Say what you will about the concept, but this really, truly is... <laughs> A very danceable hip hop album, well produced. There's a superstar cast here. You can't go wrong. I mean, it's good one. Yeah, it's yeah. a big one. Okay, and then R. Kelly, right? R. Kelly, Love Letter is his newest, I and uh, I think he's trying to put everything behind him, Wouldn't which you? which is yeah. a good idea, <laughs> <laughs> and just stick to being being Mr. R. M. B. Sure. And this is a record very much in the the style of Sam Cooke and uh -huh. Marvin Gaye. Yeah. And uh, there's even. Acknowledging this season a Christmas love letter no kidding. on the record, right? Really? So, uh, you know, we're going to maybe be talking a little bit more about Christmas music next week. Yeah, but the comparison of, of Sam Cooke and Marvin Gaye, does it live up to it? Is it? He's got that silky, smooth, yeah, soulful yeah, sound. Yeah. Absolutely. Because that's, that's mm -hmm. top billing. Okay, and then. On uh, the polar opposite end of go. the spectrum, to the other side, uh, right. we have the, this is a super group <laughs> called The Damn Things. This is Scott Ian of Anthrax, uh -huh. uh, some of the members of Fallout Boy and a band called Every Time I Die. So, you know, they're very experienced in their own right. So they've come together to show their, their appreciation for classic hard rock music, and that's exactly what this is. I actually accidentally grabbed the uh, exclusive Record Store Day release mm -hmm. for this one. Mm -hmm. I meant to grab the full length, but um, we still have a couple of these left. So. That's good. Yeah, it's wonderful. It's a good Scott one. Okay, that's the new stuff. A lot of good stuff out. For the holidays. All right, you got a ba uh, holiday baby name picked out? You gonna share with us? Uh, yeah, we're pretty torn right now really between torn. two. Not gonna let it out of the bag, huh? <laughs> okay, we'll ask you next week. <laughs> All right, guys, good to see you both. That's Thanks, your new Chris. music Tuesday.